Can somebody crank my back? Crank it. So just. No, you gotta crank it. You gotta crank it. Crank the back. Crank it. Crank the back. You know. Wait, do it that hand though. Yo, chill, man. Welcome back to another video, guys. This is your host, Junior Garcia. Don't forget to like, to subscribe, to turn on those notifications. Man. Welcome back to another video, guys. This is your host, Junior Garcia. You know, as real as I can be, today we're in Staten Island and we are doing a siding job. For who? Look over there. Let's hit the intro, guys. Hey, guys, welcome to another remodel. We are in another remodel. Keep watching, keep watching. So today we're working in Staten Island in conjunction with Chris from Stout and we're doing the siding portion of it. And if you know Chris, right, leave a comment below. And today we're installing James Hardy siding to the front of the house. But if you're noticing this, the house wrap is blue skin. And what is blue skin, right? Go to blueskin.com or Henry blue skin and you guys will find out this is the best house wrap for your home. So we're installing James Hardy siding is that trim and then vinyl siding on three sides of the home so they wanted a combination of both because generally people will look at the front of the house so let me take you to the side where the guys are working so guys we're in the rear section of the house right as you can see it's a ranch home right so everything is like one story they already installed the door for us do you see the plywood by the other entry that's a basement door the door didn't come in. Chris is gonna take care of that door. He says just cover the whole house in siding. So everything else right now is gonna be aluminum around the windows and then vinyl siding to the, to the three sides of the home. So guys, I wanted to show you the schedule. So if you have a half inch insulation, it's 3.2. If you have 5 eighths, it's four. If you have three quarter inch in R max, guys, in R max, it's equivalent to five, R value five. So this double foiled insulation is the way to go. Why? Because it avoids thermal bridging in your house, right? Hot and cold. Cold on the outside, hot on the inside, or hot on the outside, cold on the inside. So it doesn't create that. Let's go talk to Luis. He doesn't like to talk in the camera. Luis, yo hablé con Chris y él dice que tenemos que sacar el siding que ahora quiere Hardy a los tres lados. So, huh? Quiere los rompemos la casa también. No, no, él quiere, él quiere de verdad, de verdad. Él quiere que le ponga Hardy a los tres lados. So la prima el, el, el lado de adelante es Hardy, pero estos otros tres lados él no quiere vinal. So él dice he doesn't want cheap siding, he wants good Hardy siding. So no ponga más nada ahí. Sácalo, de verdad, sácalo. Sácalo ya. Puede comenzar a sacarlo. Sácalo de ahí, no lo vamos a usar. No, no, está limpiando. Está relajado. <laughs> hey, Lewis doesn't like being on camera, but he's always like the perfect person, my go-to, to get a good laugh, right? Uh, and I've been knowing Lewis now 15 years, 14, 15 I've no, years. I've noticed almost all your, um, like your crew, you know them for 10 plus years. Yeah, I definitely know most of my crew for 10 plus years. Generally, it's... So like they started with you. Right, since they, they started. It was Freddie and Louis that started, and then their cousins, and their brothers, and then, you know, so forth and so forth. Oh, and so this is a family company. It is. Carpenter's Touch is a real family company. Not like... Right? You want to hear something that you really generally hear. You think about corporate America. And I, and you know, and I think about corporate America. Let, let, let's use a, a common corporate name, Coca-Cola, right? And you think about corporate America. But then you go into glassdoor.com and you're trying to find out what's really happening in certain, certain corporate companies. And you find out a lot of things are not happening right. You know, everything is all about numbers. It's not about relationships. A lot of things that are happening, you know, people that you thought were really connected to you are really not. 
and they're just pushing numbers. Just do this, do that, check this off. Let's do a video together. Let's do this. Let's have lunch. But in reality, they're fake. They're not genuine. I'm going to tell you this why, because I'm a genuine person. I'm, you know, if I do something wrong, tell me. If you do something wrong, I'll tell you. I'm very, very genuine. I'm down to earth. I'm a people's person. But you know, when you're dealing with corporate America and you know who you are, that's what happens. You're fake. So you're upset with one of your... Uh... I'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna mention what corporate branch I am upset with, but when I, I like to tell, you know, let's be genuine, let's be honest, right? Don't beat around the bush. Be truthful, you know? I thought we had a relationship going. I guess we're not. Did you sign a contract with them? I signed a contract with them. You know, I'm upset. Why? Because it kind of binds me of me really sharing my true full heart, right? Uh, what, what I say this to the young contractors out there that are probably trying to join or partner up with a corporate company, guess what? They cheated on you. They definitely cheat on you. So you work really hard, no rewards, nothing is given to you. You know, they pat you on the back once a year and that's it. But get, you know, the reality is I have families to feed. I have crews to take care of. Let me show you the it back. Wasn't GAF? It wasn't GAF. They're the best. They're the best in the market. They're the best corporate. You know, they're, they're inviting me back again. Where? Back to the GAF corporate. It's not GAF, guys. What's it? What's their name? Just tell us. It was. There you guys have it. Um, I know I went a little off, right? And I started getting a little mad. And But, you know, I got a phone call from one of my corporate partners. Really mad, you know, not genuine people. But, you know, and I went on a little rant down there. But, you know, th we're done with them, right? Don't forget to like, to subscribe. And, you know, I might reveal it on my next video. Keep watching.